Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to Rick Games and welcome back to Guardians of the Galaxy Telltale series. We just lost, lost Drax and we're all very, very sad. Whoa. What was that? That looked like it was important. Man, she looks pretty rough, huh? Beat up a little bit, yeah. Ugh. It smells even worse. Not that I'm surprised. After what we've put her through. We'll fix her we'll up. fix her up. She'll look and smell good as new. Yeah, we can fix this, right? Not so sure the ship's ever gonna be the same, Pete. Sorry. That sounds very the thing defeated. Think about, you know, with uh... ah, damn it, Pete, Drax. What I'm saying is, I know it must have been tough, but it was the right call. Glad I didn't Thanks. have to make it. So, uh, yeah. I think his family would be proud. Yeah. I hope he gets to see them again. Yeah, I don't, I don't really believe that, but nice thought. His family would be proud? Yeah, whatever you have to tell yourself, Peter. Oh, what? come on! Look around, Rocket. There are two less guardians here, in case you haven't noticed. You need the back up. I just thought we had a leader who would fight for us. All of us. I just want to hear what he was thinking. I'm with Pete on this one. He wanted to jump! To save us! What's so hard to understand it's about that? It's hard to understand why you'd allow him to do that! I'm not his boss. Please, I'm not his... the anger is overwhelming. Yes, I'm gonna tell you one more time, lady. Back up. You back up! I ain't going anywhere. <laughs> Don't! The guy did what he had to do. Stop it! I ain't happy about Drax being gone, but I am happy to still be breathing. You should embrace that a little bit. That we can stand here having this stupid argument I at all. I trusted Peter to keep us all safe. I thought he understood that. Look what you're doing to Mantis, huh? You think Drax would have wanted that? He gave his life so we could all still be together. Don't waste that. I never asked him to do that. No I don't need did. anyone dying for me. I can't take it! There is too much conflict with you! Too much anger, resentment, and sadness. Your pain is overwhelming each of you. It's too much for me to be around. If you disagree with each other so much, why don't you all simply walk away? Your feelings for one another are all at war. Well, because we're family. And you don't quit on family. Like you didn't quit on Drax? Like Drax didn't quit on all of us? Like you're not gonna quit until we're all patronized to death? Being around you, this is too painful for me. Thank you for freeing me and teaching me that the loudest shouter is usually the most correct. <laughs> but I must go. Where are you? Where are you going? That's got to be some sort of record. She's basically been chained to us up until now. She gets two minutes of free will and we drive her away. I am Groot. I am proud of myself in a weird way. You're right about one thing, Peter. We are family. <coughs> but Thanos was my family too. And You're sometimes telling. being in a family sucks. So, good luck. What are you doing? Gamora, wait. Please, don't do this. It wasn't me who did this, Peter. It was you. What? Are you kidding me? I got one word for you, Pete. Yikes. What? Why would you do that? What? What What did he say? Groot, come on! Is he leaving too? I am Groot. He's going. He's leaving us. Why? I am Groot. Peter? What about me? Oh, come on, man. Not you too. Groot, the Guardians need you. Yeah, Groot. A team's not a team with only two people. That's a duo. A team up at best. 
I am Groot. He says he doesn't want Mantis to be alone. I am Groot. That I have you. I am Groot. He knows what it's like to be the last of his kind and alone out there. I am Groot. And he knows how important it is to find someone to look out for you. I am... I am Groot. He says I need to stay and keep an eye on you. I am Groot. Oh, man. He's saying a bunch of sad stuff. I love you, buddy. I am Groot. This is sad. All right, we gotta spend everything, all this time getting all the band back together here. Weird left-handed handshake. Fine, let's do it. Goodbye, friend. I am grouped. Uh, oh, hug. Always hug. Come here. Always hug. Yeah, just go on, why don't you? Before he starts getting mean, he starts white fanging people. Go on, go back to your kind. Oh, Guru! Go on, get. Oh, Rob Rocket's crying. Who knew trees had such big hearts, huh? What a jerk. I'm really gonna miss that tree. Yeah, me too. Alright, so what the hell do we do? Well, Rocket, I guess you'll be leaving too. Uh, about that, I think I'm gonna stick around for a while. But you said you wanted to go. I know what I said. I was just considering my options. As is my right. That's right. I know. So what are we doing? Well, what now? Only one thing left to do at a moment like this. Let's get hammered. Barkey! Yep. Two of your most lethal concoctions, please. Oh, Better we make it three. Blue. Next up is Best your idea you've had in a long time. <sighs> Tell me about Eight or nine rounds, then we find Hawk. We have some breaking news. Reports are flying in about a violent Kree attack on Jabari 5. Millions of are dead. Hey, Pete. I found her. Well, this isn't good. Now we have to go kill Hala. With just two guardians. What? That was the last... What? Son of a bitch! I thought I downloaded the... Oh, I got all confused in my head, Skull. Oh. All right. Continue. Please. Is there no next time on whatever? Did I seriously put 10 minutes into this episode not knowing that the episode was over? Ugh. Yeah, I did that. All right. Time out, everybody. I got to go download the other one now. Hey, hey, everybody. What's going on? Welcome back to Rick Games and welcome back to Guardians of the Galaxy. Time for Don't Stop Episode 5. Sorry about uh, messing up earlier. The The... Uh, the, the heavy weight of losing Drax distracted me. And I was a fool to believe, just a fool to believe, that uh, I wasn't near the end of the episode. Should have made my own... Previously, our Guardians of the Galaxy. I forgot to plug in my headphones. I'm sorry. <sighs> but this thing is way too powerful for anyone to wield. Yes, we know. We broke we the thing. Destroy it. We did. We destroyed it. My dear... 
lost to yes, me. we know. Hella was very upset that we took away her son. He's destroyed because of him. She means me. I mean it this time, man. When we get out of here, I'm out. You said that, Rocket, but you're still I need here. You to respect that. This is my chance, Peter. Yeah. To protect my new family. Like I never did for Hobot and Kamaria. Tell me what I have to do. My family will be proud. And I will tell them of my best friend, Peter Quill. See, Drax was happy to go. <laughs> yeah, we lost Drax. He's dead. He's dead. He jumped. I just thought we had a leader who would fight for us. All of us. You know, I really wish I shoved Gamar in a tube. Gone, but I am happy to still be breathing. Thank you for freeing me and teaching me that the loudest shouter is usually the most correct. But I must go. Mantis left. We just saw this. Yes, yes, yes. The galaxy may need guarding, Peter, but not by us. Gamora, wait. I don't know what that means. It wasn't me who did this, Peter. It was you. I very much disagree. But you feel how you feel, so eh, good luck. Good luck on your own. Without your family. Family meaning us. I mean, Thanos is dead and Nebula's dead. They kind of glossed over that in the previous Leon right there. Uh, go more, or, uh, uh, yeah, Nebula. Nebula died too. Yep. It was all very sad. Should have been there. <laughs> uh, I'm sure there's some way to... F we're, we're, we're talking about the Infinity Forge and there's a way to bring people back from the dead and so on and so forth. Yes, I know we're adapting to all kinds of choices. Next up, is your Kodak device <sighs> making you sick? A new study... Eight or nine rounds, then we find Hoth. Uh, we have some breaking news. Reports are flying in about a violent Kree attack on Jabari 5. Yeah, we saw this. Millions are feared dead. Hey, Pete. Feared. We found her. Earlier today, reports came in of a deformed monster rampaging across the galaxy, attacking planets at random. It appeared as if the creature was able to draw life out of innocent bystanders without even touching them. Without them. Without touching them now. Your time's up, Star-Lord. Said the lady. I will hang you down to the end of the galaxy, said that lady. For some reason, who no longer has a... I should destroy nowhere and then continue to Earth. There will be no home for you anywhere. All right, for some reason, she used to have a voice actress, a very nice one. Death is coming, Peter Quill. I guess maybe it was the same lady that did Gamora, or did, did um, Holy Nebula? Crap. And they both meant that she just up and quit one day. just ditched us when we've got this planet nuking lady to deal with. Yeah, right? Crazy. Perfect timing. Now we gotta deal with Hala as a death monster with a gun that can blow a hole in a planet. Oh yeah. We are so screwed it's not even funny. We're so it's screwed. It's kinda of funny in a fatalistic sort of way. I mean, I guess. Guardian's gone. Drax dead. And Hala just seems to be getting stronger. Yeah, the last couple of days have gone from being a pile of crap to a pile of crap on fire. <sighs> but even with all that, just want you to know, I believe in you, man. Thanks. I mean, you always figure something out. That's why I stuck around. Thanks, Rocket. Really appreciate it. <coughs> so you reached Rocket's a friend. Yeah, yeah, you gotta believe in something. You're the closest thing to me right now. There's only one way we can stop her. We need to get the Guardians back together. Oh, come on! Try, try on your own. We have to get the guardians back together. Groot, what are you doing here? I am Groot. Don't worry, I'm way ahead of you on that one. I am Groot. So Gamora, we just need Gamora. Why? This is worse than I thought. I could sense that remnants of the forge still existed. They must be. Inside of Hala. Yeah, we figured that one out. Here's where the forge granted life. Hala can now take it. We we know. With every life she claims, she'll gain more power. We're we're getting this. We're doomed. And Mary had a little lamb. These are things we know. So sorry. 
I had no idea. Yes, you did. Oh, we said this already. Or I did anyway. It's getting better and better. There's nothing better about this. Sarcasm. The Eternity Forge is highly unstable. It would be extremely toxic to Hala. It's likely that she needs to kill to keep herself alive. So you're saying if she stopped killing people, the forge would consume her. I am Groot. But you have seen what she has become. Hala is too powerful a foe for the Guardians to take on. So let's call the Avengers. <laughs> now well, we're certainly not going to beat her with that kind of attitude. Oh, well. I'm sorry it's hard for me to be positive when I can feel every person that Hala murders. And yeah, chill out. Um, I am Groot. The I agree. Guardians are broken. I don't see a world where you can actually defeat Hala. We, we, we just need... We don't need to together, beat her. You all hated each other. We don't... I can't imagine a time when you didn't hate each other. It wasn't all bad, Mantis. We had plenty of good times. Come on, guys. I'll be out here. Yeah, you should have seen us when we killed Look, Thanos. Mantis, you didn't see us at our best. I am Groot. Wait, you want to do what? Groot? Wants to show us something. Okay. Oh, actually, I have to physically do it. Okay. Rocket. I guess Rocket doesn't get to hold hands. How can she just do that now? Like. That didn't make much sense, but okay, sure. I mean, neither does the empath thing that she has currently, so... Sure, whatever. Um, she can fight now in the movies. That's interesting. Yes, hi, hello. Mm. Hands off me, man. I'm innocent. You got the wrong guys. Oh, you mean to tell me there's another Rodan and Tree duo out there? Yes! who were scanned and ID'd by several bystanders. Yes. And caught red-handed. I am Groot. Yes, yes, we know who you are. <laughs> Forget it, Groot. These bucketheads can't understand you. Bucketheads. <laughs> Don't worry. I know how to handle this. As soon as they lock us up, I'm going to go up to the biggest, baddest dude in there and knock him out. Oh. Hi. Drax. Oh boy. Hey. I did not know this was an animal prison too. I am Groot. And I am Drax the Destroyer. Do not attempt to challenge me. I will tear you limb from limb or snout from tail. Whichever would be more painful. I challenged you. I'm still here. That is because you cheated. You had a weapon and I did hey, not. You take it easy. <clears throat> Knock it off. So this is all how we all met all in right. this episode right. or in this version. Universe? I don't know. Sure. Hey, don't get too comfortable. We'll be back to take you to permanent lockup soon. Thanks. Who is this loser? Call me. Star Lord. Oh my god. I'm sure you've all heard of me. Especially you. Mm, I am Groot. I don't know. I can't take anyone with facial hair seriously. You're literally covered nice in hair. You, Groot. What kind of tree are you? Spruce? Elm? I am Groot. Yeah, you already said that. Uh, you don't seem to understand that. Hello. I could tell you guys are the real badasses in the room. Legendary outlaws like me. Oh. Not you. Oh. We're too good. Poor little purple headed man. Up in here. What you think? The second the Nova Corps start running background checks on us, none of us are ever going to see the sweet light of day again. Which I have a mustache. And I'm still Star Lord. Look, so here's the deal. We're breaking out of here. I like that I can pick what he says and it just comes out as I angry. Any of you. Settle down in there. All of you. No. I will not settle. No prison can contain me. 
I'll go gladly if this giant ass won't be there. My ass is the correct proportion for my body. It is 100% pure muscle. I don't need to hear about your ass muscles. <laughs> no one does. I am Groot. Fighting isn't going to get us anywhere. We need to work together. Hey, to admit it, Stash Lord is right. Ah! We're fighting the wrong people. I just came up with a brilliant plan that's totally original. I'm calling Can't it. Wait to hear this. The Great Escape. That's you see that terrible. Guy there? He's the only one with the key card to get us out of here. But there's no way we can get to it. So we gotta escape another way. There's a force field all around us, but not mm. below us. And that's where you come in, muscle man. Hmm. I agree to this nickname. You are gonna use those beefy mitts of yours to dig us a tunnel to the other side of the force field. Beefy mitts? We don't have anywhere to hide all the debris, so this tree, well, you're gonna have to eat it all. What? And once we're open. Leave it to Groot, man. Leave it to Groot. Gotcha. Huh? Is that you, Rooks? Rooks? That son of a bitch, Rooks. <laughs> you got knocked the F out, dude. <laughs> I got your shit now, too. I'm not going to lie. A couple of you might die. But know that I will never forget you. Or we could just use the key card. There you go. I love this tree. I agree. I think this is the beginning of a beautiful friend. Escape. You were going to say escape. Friendship. I was going to say friendship, but escape will do. Let's go. I am Groot. There's probably some epic music playing right now that we can't play here. Just to let y'all know. I, I was wrong about you guys. There's a reason you all ended up together. I never knew. You're not a team, or a family, or friends in the conventional sense. Yeah, it was all the mustache. Peter, I don't think that's it. Are you sure? I don't know, Mantis. I, I really think it was the mustache. It was not the mustache. <laughs> Ah, uh, we can be like that again. We've all forgotten how much we need each other. But we can still be like that again. We're the guardians of the galaxy. It's time we start acting like it. Yeah! Then let's go get them back. Let's do it! I am groomed. I think he said let's F and go gamers. Whatever that means. Excuse me. Too much Diet Coke in the old Tum Tum. You know how it goes. So we gotta get Gamora. Like, Drax is dead. Nebula's dead. I am great. Okay. Just gotta find Gamora. There you go. It's anyone's guess where she is. She's still an assassin. She'll know where to go if she don't want to be found. It's true. Mantis. You were able to track down the shrine using your abilities. Do you think you could find one of us too? I can usually only sense someone who is nearby. Is she nearby? But I may be able to extend my range with your help. I am group. I have an idea. What? Okay. How come I didn't have to aim for her hand? I'm going to love it. This time. What is happening? What is going on? Are you melting the ship? Are you breaking reality? What is happening? I'm very washed out right now because of you. Cool, we're in where, space. Uh, where are we? You and I have merged minds. This is inside my mind. It seems kind of empty. 
I've never shared this with anyone before. And you didn't die or anything. That was a possibility? This is amazing. I wasn't sure it would work, but it did. Merging minds, huh? This is getting a little intimate, Mantis. We have to get close. So that my mind can see far. Okay, I'll make it happen. This island here represents your subconscious mind, Peter. Ah, uh, moving those along. Other islands represent your friends. Cool. Nora could be anywhere in the galaxy by now. Right. In order to find her, we'll need to build a bridge. Uh, bridge. A literal yes. bridge. A bridge of feelings. Uh, okay. I won't be able to do it myself. I'll need your help. Let's give it a shot. <sighs> Okay, let's get this party started. Let's get this horrible party started. If we can reach your friends' islands, we'll learn where they are. Now, I need you to concentrate very hard. When you think about the Guardians, what emotions do you feel the strongest? Laughter. Love, anger, frustration, worry, pity. Uh, yeah, stick with love, dude. Sure. Love. Oh, what the hell was that? On this plane, emotions are able to take physical form. Okay. Those are memories that you can connect to with your feelings. If we focus on your emotional relationships with the rest of your team, they will be easier to find. This is so weird. Hmm. Okay. Explore memories. We can get her back, Pete, if we charge the forge. We can revive Lila. Let's rock it. Rockets over there. Okay. Let's do this one. You're the one who's going to keep us from falling apart. There's Gamora. Sparkle, sparkle. Sunshine. There we go. So let's go over there. That's where Gamora is. You're doing well, Peter. Thanks. I'm beginning to sense Gamora. Neat. Don't we don't we don't we need to go over there? Okay, I can't activate my rocket boots. Uh fine. Do this one. This is my chance, Peter. Oh. To protect my new family. Curious. Your bond with Drax is very strong. But I don't understand. You you can sense Drax, but Drax is dead. I can't explain it. But I can certainly feel his presence through your emotions. Okay. You've told me He's not dead, is he? Guardians. That's good. But in order to find your friends. I'll need more. I like really How love the guardians. Feel about being guardians. Right now, kind of pissed, scared. Uh, regret, annoyed, proud, pissed off, conflicted, conflicted. Come on, get, get! I'm really there. I think they're conflicted. Okay, here's everybody. And we're doing this one again. What do you got? She was the only thing keeping me alive. And I couldn't save her. Okay. More stuff with Rocket. I haven't seen Groot at all in this mess. Is this Drax or Gamora? I discarded everything. Even the things that reminded me of my beloved Kamaria and Hobart. This is very unsettling, but please keep trying. All right, then. To the Gamora flashy bulb glow light here. Gamora, I don't know why you're purple. He was a monster, yes. But he was also my family. Talking about me? Uh, can we just go now, please? Are we done? You're doing great. 
I didn't think I was actually capable of feeling this many emotions. I'm so deep. I am. Let's just try once more. No. You and Come the on. have had so many amazing adventures. How would you describe your happiest moment with them? Happy. Awesome. I think that's enough. If you explore all these memories, we should have what we need to build our bridges. Well, let's start with this one, I guess. Good old Rocky boy. Hey, I was surrounded by adoring fans. I couldn't let them go thirsty. Silly, silly rocket. Is it all going to be stuff from this game? Your emotions towards Rocket are extremely complicated and varied. Okay. Cool, good talk. Created a bridge to Rocket. That's the bridge. Makes sense. Rocket's been here the whole time. In spite of everything you've been through, Rocket cares about you a great deal. He must really value your friendship to remain at your side. I'm glad he stuck around. He's a good friend. I suspect that is why he stayed. He knows how well you two get along. How much you need each other. Am I just doing this for so, statues of my friends? But what's with all these other light orb thingies? They represent your feelings, Peter. You should explore them. We've done this already. Can we? Here you go. Here's to the Drax. Drax the Destroyer has purpose once again. Yes. Drax is back. Cool. Bridge if to Drax. Is still out there. Your feelings can lead us to him. All right, let's go. Be great if there was some kind of sound effect for that. A bridge to dot 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 Drax. Can I move faster? Like at all? Touch. Wait, this is... What the hell does this mean, Mantis? It means Drax is alive. And it means you left him for dead. <laughs> Poor Drax. He must be so lonely. No. No, there is no way he could have survived back there. Apparently there is. This proves that he's alive. We wouldn't be able to locate him otherwise. The others will be so excited that he's still alive. His sacrifice caused so much turmoil. Hopefully this will repair what was broken in your team. Maybe. Oh, by the way, Gamora? What a weird way to find out that Drax is still alive. But we're not done here. Keep looking. Cool, let's go do this thing now. Gamora. The whole reason we started doing this. Alright, here we go. Let's create the bridge. I still can't believe we did it. Thanos is gone. Oh yeah, her happiest moment. Um, okay, come on. There are so many contrasting emotions that you feel towards Gamora. Mm-hmm. That's called an erection. You have rocket boots. Move faster. <sighs> Beep. And I know this place. I've been here. This is Thanos' training room from Gamora's memory. Uh-huh. 
Gamora hated her father. Why would she go back? Because she has zero family left, yeah. We all created the Guardians because none of us had anywhere else to go. This is the only place Gamora could think to return to. She might have unresolved feelings attached to this place. I got feelings Stay of... With us. So that island will probably show us the Milano. I got feelings of getting the hell out of here. I'm proud of you, Peter. You did well connecting with your emotions. I know it couldn't have been easy for someone such as yourself. Why does your... Not everyone can connect with people as easily as I can. Surprising people is my specialty. Yes, and you are certainly full of surprises. Why does your outfit so, have a boob window? To pick him up. Who should we get first? Gamora. We'll grab Gamora first, then Drax. Because Gamora will come back when she realizes Drax is alive and we need some help. Get in Gamora, get in Gamora, get in Gamora. Sanctuary training sands collision. Cool, we're here. Hey, Gamora, just uh, sit outside and hock the horn. Like, do we really need to make this a thing? Just like, like, yo, we're outside. Jax is alive. Come on, party. Don't you think Gam's going to be a little pissed at you? Gam's. And what are you going to say? I'm sure I'll think of something in the moment. Oh, yeah, this is going to be great. Pete, think harder. Yeah. Gamora? You've got some nerve following me here of all places. I told you I was done. I'm not in a very charitable mood, Peter. Leave. Or I'll make you leave. Or are you here to fight? <laughs> I won't go easy on you. Whoa, whoa. There is no need for violence here, okay? Let's just... Let's just talk it out. I've said enough. Okay. Nice! I didn't see the arrow until it was too late. You said you keep everyone together. I'm trying to do that, and you keep leaving. Listen to me, Jesus. Is more powerful than ever. No kidding. Why are you shooting at me? And now Drax is dead. Drax no, isn't dead. He's not dead. What? Drax is alive. Why didn't you open with that? Drax is alive? And you didn't bother mentioning it before? You tried to kill me. I was working up to it. Work up to it faster next time. Fine. Come help me save Drax. By that thing. You said he was gone. I thought he was, but he's not. You look, I, I didn't know how to find you, so Mantis helped me search for you with her empath powers. And when we were doing that, I, uh, I felt Drax. Oh, God, that sounds disgusting. I didn't really, I didn't feel him. I, I was just, I was inside Drax. No, I was not, wait, I was not inside Drax. I was just... I, we, we were, we, he's alive. Ah, what? Ah, I just don't get it. Why does everything just work out for you? I got the archer syndrome. No matter what you do, everything just conveniently works out for the great Star-Lord. You call this working out? The guardians are scattered. Drax nearly got eaten. You almost killed me two seconds ago. Oh, and Hall is out to destroy the galaxy because of me. But despite that, we're all unscathed. So far. So Drax happened to survive, but you told him to sacrifice himself, knowing full well that it could kill him. I didn't tell him Can't to. Can't you even pretend to be bothered by that? Show me something, anything. You're asking if I feel bad? Of course I feel bad. Then why won't you show it? Hey, what do you want from me? You want me to wander around crying? That isn't my style, Gamora. You shrug through everything, free of consequence. No, I don't! Oh, well, I... I feel punished for merely existing. Hugger. I've done so many horrible things. Hug it out. I fought. I... 
tortured a little girl. All because I was too scared to stand up to Thanos. Ah, uh, yeah, that's, that's gross. And now, my sister is dead. <coughs> Excuse me. I'll never be able to forgive myself. You shouldn't, but right now... You made a mistake coming back, Peter. You were as much of a victim as Nebula was. But Thanos is to blame. Not you. Thanos may have given the order, but the blade was in my hand. Cool. But, uh... Rocket pushes people away to hide his pain. Drax revels in his rage. But I don't know how to get past it. All the lives I've ruined. I've hurt so many people. Despicable acts I did to serve Thanos. You haven't hurt me, Gamora. Ever. Everyone that gets close to me winds up hurt. Well, you, you kicked me if and I hit me in a bunch. You, I'll just make it worse. Oh, for God's sake! I don't even know why you bothered coming here. Uh, I missed you. Gamora, I came here because I... Because I missed you. And I need you. But we Peter, gotta go... I... I missed you too. Oh. Well, that's very lovely. So let's I go... close my eyes at night, and I'm right back here. Well... I'm that frightened girl. Unsure of what or who to trust. I want nothing more than that pain to be over. You have to forgive yourself, Gamora. It's the only way you can move forward. Right. You're right. <laughs> Some tears look horrible. They look like scars down her face. Okay, but Drax is dying. We should. We should go. Uh, um, we. You, you. You could cry on the ship. You want to cry on the ship on the way? Because we have to go get Drax. Did you forget about Drax? That guy you thought was dead up until like a minute ago? Can we, uh, you know, I mean, maybe, maybe Mantis can be like more of a therapist than I can be? Because it's time to go. Gotta go get Drax. Uh. All right. Huh. Huh? You expecting any calls today? Hello. Uh, I do not know how you escaped the shrine. There's nowhere you can run to now. Why is there no voiceover for this? New phone. Who's this? Uh, sorry. I don't recognize this number. Who is this? That's pretty funny. You know who this is. How the accuser. You have stolen everything from me, and yet you're stealing lives and such like this. Uh, I'll kill everyone you know. Yeah, sure. Everyone you ever loved. Oh, excuse me. See ya. You're unbelievable, Quill. Yeah, I am groomed. Screw her. We need yeah, to save said, Drax. Did Hala always look that gnarly? No. As I said, the forge is taking its toll on her. You guys were there, right? <laughs> She's coming from nowhere. We've got to hustle. Keep the engine running. I'll be back soon. Keep the engine running. Are we not on the way to save Drax? Because that, that it really feels like that's where we should be. We should be going. We should be going there, like right now, to get Drax. Because we left him for dead. Okay, here we go. Still alive. Uh, I don't know. Don't worry. If Drax is alive, I got money on that thing being dead. Yeah. Whoa. That was very right. He actually did it. What was that? There he is. Drax! Holy crap! You, you did that worm was that was you came out of it like you were inside it and then you you came out that's amazing you doubted me peter quill <sighs> um now what's wrong man you look pretty down for a guy who just defied death i was merely 
reflecting on the circumstances. The creature did not give up easily. Our battle raged for hours. I felt proud. You should but be I proud. Think I was happier butchering that hideous worm than when I got revenge on my daughter's killer. How could that be? I cannot find a reason for it. That worm has no importance to me. How revenge doesn't bring you happiness. It just delays the pain a while. It's about what you want, not what you need. Well, that is incredibly wise. I am not used to hearing such wisdom from you, Peter. In the midst of battle, I felt such exhilaration and nothing else. I spared not a single thought for Kamaria. I think I am afraid that with each passing moment, our memory will continue to disappear. I fear that once I forget, Kamaria will die a second death. You'll never forget. His feelings will not stop. I don't think that's true at all. Your memories of your family will last forever. Kamaria will always be a part of you. That is impossible. She is not a part of me. She is dead. Sarcasm, uh, metaphor, or whatever. I am not used to being afraid of anything. Oh, if only I were dead. These feelings would not cause me such distress. No matter how hard I try. Okay, I know you wanted to die, but that kind of attitude, it's not healthy. You need to give up on this ridiculous death wish. Death is the only solace I thought I could find. Have solace in us. I was not completely honest with you before. I did wish to protect the Guardians, but part of me hoped that I might see my daughter again in the afterlife. If such a thing does exist, I do not know. But the thought of reuniting with my family. I don't think Kamaria would want you to get yourself killed just so you could see her. You can't just give up, Drax. There is so much left to live for. I always taught Kamaria to persist, no matter how daunting the adversary. I will fight this fear, and I will defeat it for her. Thank you, my friend. Cool. I feel more sure of my path forward. Great. Can you get on the ship? We have to stop a Halbeast. Hey guys, it's all clear. Bring the ship down. Now, let us return to your garbage heap of a ship. The galaxy is counting on us to stop Hala. And I have wasted enough time beside this rotting carcass. Hey, it might be a garbage heap, but it's our garbage heap. <laughs> Most of that garbage is yours, Peter. Alright, just get in. Stop being a... Butthole. The great colon escape is what we have done. And once again, we are escaping the dead colon of the monster. I don't know what I'm trying to say here. Either way, band's back together, baby! Except Nebula. Nebula's still dead, but that's neither here nor there. Band's back together, baby! Let's go stop the holla, 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 holla! Now that I am here, let us go retrieve the Cranky Assassin. Cranky, huh? Cranky Assassin's here. Why did you think that she was gone? Oh, I assumed you would get me first, as I am your favorite and most loyal friend, who has never done you any harm and has harmed all of your enemies. Repeatedly, I will list them in order of harm. Uh, you really don't have From to. From along the pincher, the alien who kicked you in the shin, Servo 66, the robot who electrocuted your groin area. Remember that little detail where we all thought you were dead? I do, and it is not little. Recovering my body for a hero's burial should have been your priority. 
No. This is us. We're here. Mantis, there you are. Welcome home, everyone. I am Groot. We missed you too, buddy. Root says it's so good to see you all. I figured that out. Look at you, Peter. Somehow you managed to get us all back in the same room. Funny for the think we'd see each other after last time. Unless, you know, we ended up in the same prison. Again. Yeah. First off, I wanted to apologize. I was acting like kind of a jerk? Jackass? Coward? Ooh, ooh, I am Groot? Yes. Watch your language. I am sorry for all of those things. I wish I had better news for you, but uh, things have turned into a bad monster movie out there. Yes. Hala and the Eternity Forge have merged into a singular being. But where the relic granted life, Hala absorbs life. We accidentally created a supervillain. Go team. Yes. We created a worthy adversary. She has to be stopped before she strikes again. Hala contacted me. She said this won't end until we're dead or she is. There's only one thing we can do. I'll get the cyanide pills. <laughs> <laughs> fine, fine, I'll just get mine. The Roden is right. Our chances of victory have not improved since the last time we fought her. Hala is heading for nowhere. Well... For us. Mm -hmm. I'm open to suggestions on how we approach this. Do we have some way of capturing her? Well, you've been on a ship before. I can analyze the readings from last time and see if there's a way to take out her weapons. When in doubt, look to the data. There's got to be a weak spot or two we can exploit. That's as good a place to start as any. And it's the only plan we've got. Hala isn't going to go easy on us. We'll have to prepare to take her down. I'll be on the bridge, Pete. Come talk to me when you get the chance. So that's our plan. We're just going to go after the ship. I am Groot. Thanks, Groot. I think he can understand him now. Okay. Now, I'm going to leave this episode here. So, uh, we're off to get Hala. We're Hala's ship. We're in the very, very end of everything right now. We're doing great. Stuck with us. We're so good. We're so good. Everything is so good. Let's do it, babies. Let's do it. My little babies, my little nerdy babies. Let's do it. Oh, I'm so excited. We're almost done. We're almost done this whole thing. Hooray! Uh, but yeah, that'll be next time on Rec Games. We'll be finishing this ep this entire series. Let's go. Go team. Go us. Go everyone. Thank you very much for watching. But we're not done yet. We still got one more left. Until then, thank you very much for watching. Please like the video and subscribe to Rick Games. It helps me out a lot when you do that. Check out the annotations at the end of the video for more videos than I've done. And next time on Rick Games. We're ending this game. We're ending this whole series. The Guardian series is coming to an end until they put out a new game, which might not be too far off in the future, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll see what happens to this game next time on Red Games. Bye.